Beehive tutorial for beginners where we'll guide you through the process of getting started with this powerful email newsletter platform. So to begin with, you're going to be starting with start free trial. Right? So I'm going to give you a step-by-step -step tutorial on how you're going to start with it. So first name. All right, so once you have started writing your email information, they will be asking you for verification. All right, for now, for your verification, access your email, and they will send you a link saying verify your email. All right, so here's an example. So click on verify, and now they will take you back to the website, confirming your sign up. And after this, they will ask you, uh, what is your current level of newsletter experience? So if you're new to this game, you can just go to Curious. If you wanted to, if you already know what a newsletter is, you can get started with Doobie. Now, if you have been using newsletter, you could go with experienced. So for me, I'm really new to this. I'm just going to go with Curious. And then after you have confirmed your email, what you'll be going to do is write your newsletter. If you have an image, you can upload it there, like an icon or a logo that you could use. So for me, I'm going to write tutors, uh, tutors newsletter. It's suggested for me already. And then they will have a subdomain name and tags. So let's say my mm, newsletter is going to be about entertainment and... Hmm. Let's say gaming. Okay, entertainment, gaming, and problem music. Okay, by the way, you can search for information just to give you some, some thoughts about it. So, so they only have a maximum of three. These types of information, it's, easily, it's going to be very easy for them to search in the search engines. Okay, now, so it says here, yeah, you get to experience Beehive with a 30-day free trial. So these are the features that you could have at this very moment. Uh, powerful speed of features for you to try out. Okay, so that's a good thing. So this is the free trial, 30 days. So make the most of it using your 30 days. So start free trial, and then they will take you to this wonderful dashboard. So just close that, maybe remind me later. And then they will tell you what you need or information for you to strategize your workflow or your audiences, your engagement, monetization. So in overview, they have active subscribers, open rate, click rate, how many people have been clicking on your links, and the subscribers. And then one of the good things about their website in their dashboard is they you can import a list which is in CSV. Well, CSV is like an Excel form, so I gave I made an example. All right. So you will, if you have a list of CSV files of emails like this, uh, Beehive will automatically select all on those green areas, and they will send email to all of these lists. So to make more of your uh, newsletters to be submitted as instant as possible. They have lots of automations here, which is very handy for you when you're going to be starting your newsletter business. All right, so now anything else that we could have here? So they have export data, subscribe forms. Okay, you can make your own form for your subscription. They have widgets. All right, so if you want to add a lot of widgets that you have and uh, premium features. So right now I don't have premium features. So let's just go back to the dashboard to get us started with this. So they also have like a step, a step procedure on how you're going to do it. It's like a milestone on how you're going to uh, manage your newsletters. Okay, now so from here you can access all the tools and features Beehive offers to streamline your email marketing efforts. So to start it off, I'm going to be here is where you could start building or writing and start earning and so much they could offer you for a while a lot and it's completely easy and to manage if you could have definitely get a hang of it in just a few days. So let's explore the tabs. So on the Beehive tabs is all on the left side. So they have write, okay, grow, monetization, audience, analyze, learn. So there's nothing much more about the others, but one of the main focus you have here is the audience. Probably analyze if you're very strategic in making your newsletters. You have settings, site, help, chat, and sign out. So that's probably it. I would like to explore the right tab. So in the right tab, okay, so this is where you can create and manage your content. It provides tools for drafting, editing, and publishing posts or articles. You can compose text, add images, embed media, uh, and format your content before sharing it. So how to use it. So let's just go to write, go to posts, or 
You don't technically have to go to post. Just in your dashboard, you can see you start writing on the top right corner. And they will give you some suggestions about writing a blank draft or use a template. So a template is technically, once you have started your newsletter already, you can now start creating your constant uh, template of what your newsletter should look like. So you can have a continuous ways of sending it to different subscribers or maybe if you're going to update your newsletters with different dates or maybe information, you can have the same temp template with just updated information. So this is very handy if you have already, already started with your newsletters. Now let's just go over uh, start writing. Okay. To start writing on uh, Beehive, so what you're going to do is click, uh, after you have clicked on the right tab, you can now start to create a new post and then you can use these text editors to write your content. You can format your text, add images, videos, or other elements. And then after this, you could preview your post before publishing and then once you get satisfied, you can publish your content to make it available, available to your audiences. So now, right now, I just want to know how we're going to start it with. So you, now you are left with a blank, uh, probably blank template here. And then you can start writing very tutorials, newsletter, right? So neatly looking at this is very boring. But the good thing about this, if you're familiar with Notion, they have these feature that you could search and then they will tell you different ideas on how you're going to start it off. So they have bulleted list, image, block codes, columns, subscriber break, table of content, section, horizontal rules, code block, tables. Most of them for you to design your newsletter is all in here. You can also embed your TikTok accounts, YouTube, Instagram, Twitter, social media accounts, some footnotes. And what the f one of the best things that you could start with off with is using the AI writers or AI images. If you are kind of having struggle with the copyright images, you can go with AI image and just type your prompts and they will give you how you're going to be, your newsletter is going to be looking like. All right. So take advantage of this. It's going to be working pretty well. Okay, let's say this is my newsletter. So I'm going to write a title in my post because this is one of the most very important part titles. So I'm just going to give you an example of uh, some newsletters to give you uh, an idea on what you're going to start writing it. Remember, a newsletter should start with a good hook. So I blurred out some of the informations, but these, these are the ideas of uh, how a newsletter should start. So it says here, 30 awesome illustrators to follow for inspiration 2018 one, blah, blah, blah. And again, you can also add images, design your newsletters, and add more information about it. Okay, so now, so let's say how to do tutorials, uh, how to do probably newsletters. All right, and then after this, you add some subtitles. Now, what is a subtitle for you to, to add with? Because it's where, where people are going to be start searching on you or the information so they could easily browse through the internet and then find what they're going to be knowing about writing newsletters. All right, so if your newsletter is about probably games or websites or technology or food, uh, then it's going to be very easy for them to search for you. So you can add some authors, probably, probably someone who uh, is in partnership with you. You could add them as an author, all right? And then display date, you can also add the date that you have to display for them. It can be previously, all right? And then... They also have different templates on how you're going to use this. It can be a post on social media, it's an email, it can be a website, or an SEO, a search settings. It would look like this. They have a very good example right here at the bottom. Uh, delivery is how you're going to be managing your, uh, uh, your newsletters, how it will be sent to your subscribers. Right? And then at the bottom part, they have preview, send test, save templates. Okay, that's what I told you before. The template can help you improve your newsletters and how you're going to make it. And then you can also schedule when you're going to post it. Let's say I'm done with my newsletters. Now I can now start scheduling it. And then, oh, sorry, I can now start doing a preview. And then see how it looked like. All right. And then you can now start save template. 
So everybody will be knowing how it looks like. Right? Now, once you're done, you can now go back to your dashboard and then start making your newsletters. Automations in Beehive are predefined workflows or sequences of actions that you can set up to streamline your repetitive tasks. Right? Now, for grow part is they have the referral programs where you are going to start referring people or maybe people have referred you and they have leaderboards, fulfillment, configures, so you can explore this more in further details. But right now, I would just go to monetization, right, because they also include ads, subscriptions, and partner programs, right? And the good thing about this is you can also boost your marketplace by using different apps or probably different networks that can help you improve your newsletters, right? Pretty nifty and handy, okay? And now, the audience part is where the most important part is because it's where you're going to see your subscribers if they're really active. You can also add polls, just like this. By the way, these three things are saying that this is just a trial, right? But in this trial part, you can also try to make polls for your subscribers so they can be very active in your representations and know what your newsletter is all about. They have data, what they have, okay, and then they have subscription forms. Right. And then four more is the analyze. Okay, this is where you can see the reports of the subscribers. Okay, who are the new subscribers? New subscribers by acquisition source. So if you uh, have uploaded your newsletters in different websites or probably or different social media platforms, you could get here the information so you can start strategizing which. Uh, platform are you strong and you can keep on sending newsletters on different uh, social media sites so learn is technically where you're just going to find any information for you to know and understand about their main features so they offer educational resources tutorials and best practices to help you improve your content creation audience management monetization strategies and overall platform management. Let's just go back to the pricing part of this. Because the basic 2,500 subscribers, you have unlimited sense, web hosting, newsletters. They can also give you some premium subscriptions by subscribing to Grow, which is a $49 a month to build monthly, which will enhance your newsletters. Or if you want to have the best value, you could go to Scale, which is $99 a month. But I would suggest going to Grow because it's technically what you will be wanting for newsletters. So they have a lot of more um, comparisons here at the bottom part. If you want to know more about them, you can start to go, just go to pricing and they will tell you all information all about it. I'm just giving you the beginner part of learning how to use Beehive. So sign up today and experience the difference which be, uh, Beehive can make in growing your audience and engaging your subscribers. So if this tutorial helped you even for a little while, please consider subscribing and like this video if it uh, gave you a hand and probably success for you in the future. So thanks for watching. Don't forget to visit more of our contents and for more tips and tutorials. So now I'll say happy beehiving.